Have a majestic day, everyone! Hello, mga katropa! Welcome back again here in our channel. Shout out to all our viewers, likers, and subscribers. Today, we have another topic to be discussed. This is again the online teacher blog, or what we also know as the OTB channel. And welcome to our YouTube channel. This is again Teacher Owl, and we have another trivia about Owl. Did you know that an owl has three eyelids? One for blinking, one for sleeping, and one for keeping eyes clean and healthy. So we have our new topic of the day and this is entitled BUCOR Hiring How to Fill Up the BUCOR Personal Data Sheet or PDS A Guide to Filing the BUCOR Personal Data Sheet or PDS So let's start now! So let's start with how to fill up the BUCOR Personal Data Sheet PDS or a guide to filing the BUCOR Personal Data Sheet or PDS. Warning, any misrepresentation made in personal data sheet and work experience sheet shall cause the filing of administrative criminal case or cases against the person concerned. Fill out each of the fields in the PDS when applicable. Paper size should be legal to 116 mm by 330 mm. PDS must be printed back to back. Note, the PDS may be accomplished using the MS Word formats or MS Excel format. In the MS Excel format, all the tick boxes will automatically be marked once clicked. The PDS must hear the signature of the employee and date of accomplishment at the bottom of every page. Entries in the PDS may be filled out through handwriting or via typewriter computer if handwritten entries should be in black capital. For example, print format using a pen, all information should be provided accurately. Do not leave blank entries, put NA if not applicable. One NA will do if entire section is not applicable. For purposes of application, to a vacant position, the additional sheet for work experience should be accomplished. 1. Personal information. Employee's name to be filled out in the following format. Surname, first name, name extension if any. Middle name. A space is allotted for each character or letter in the name. Dates are in numeric format starting with the month, day, year. Specific should be given to others' responses in the civil status field. For holders of foreign dual citizenship, please select from the drop-down list the foreign country where you were born naturalized or type right and same in the space provided therein. Number two, family background. Name of spouse and parents are to be filled out of the following format. Surname, first name, name extension if any, middle name, mother's maiden name, is her maiden name or name when she was single or before marriage. List full names, first name and surname, and all your children with their birth date, month, day, and year. Number three, educational background. Indicate full name of schools to not abbreviate for elementary level. Indicate primary education if graduated. For secondary level, indicate high school or secondary if graduated under the old curriculum or junior high school or senior high school if graduated under the K-12 curriculum. Indicate in full of courses taken in college, for example, Associates in Arts, AB Economics, BS Psychology, MA in history indicate all masters of doctorate degrees taken. If graduated for every level indicate year of graduation. If not graduated in any level, indicate the highest level, level of units earned, period of attendance are are stated in school years. Example 1992 to 1996 indicated 
any scholarship and or academic honors received in each level. For civil service eligibility, indicate all civil service eligibility is earned with corresponding rating, date, and place of examination confirmant. If earned eligibility entails a license RA1080, indicate the license numbers and its dates of validity. 5. Work experience. Indicate all positions held both in the public and private employment starting from current work. Inclusive dates are indicated in numeric format, month, day, year. Indicate full position titles and complete name of department, agency, office, company. Do not abbreviate. Indicate monthly salary and figures 29,668. Salary's grade is 11 and step 1 status of employment is permanent. Indicate yes under government service. Number 6. Voluntary work or involvement in civic non-government people, voluntary organizations. Indicate the full name and address of the organization where involved as voluntary worker. Inclusive date starts from and end to should be in numeric format, month, day, and year. Indicate the number of hours of voluntary work rendered. Indicate the position, nature of voluntary work rendered. Number seven, learning and development interventions. Indicate full title of learning and development LNT interventions attended during employment. Indicate list from the most recent LNT. Inclusive dates of attendance start from and to end to should be in numeric format. Month, day, and year indicate the number of hours attended for program. Indicate the type and L and D intervention, for example, managerial, supervisory, technical. Indicate the full name of institution agency that conducted or sponsored the program. Do not abbreviate, for example, CSC civil, uh, should be Civil Service Commission. Number eight, other information indicates special skills or hobbies. Indicate in full non-academic distinction, recognition, awards received. Indicate membership in any professional association, organization by writing in full uh, said association or organization. Number 34 to 40. Indicate response to questions 34 to 40 on the right side of the sheet. Provide details or specifications for any yes response. Number 41. Indicate full name or references with the for format first name, MI or middle initial, surname, their addresses, and respective telephone numbers. Number 42 as agreement to or for completion of the PDS employee signature and the right thumb mark should be affixed in the box provided indicate. Also, uh, the government's ID number and date issuance in the boxes provided. Lastly, attach recent passport size for 0.5 cm by 3.5 cm pictures with complete name or I mean complete and handwritten name tag and signature over printed name picture must not taken within last six months. Computer generated or photocopied picture is not applicable. All right, thank you so much for watching. To Lion from the tribe of Judah, Jesus Christ, build the glory, majesty, dominion, and authority now and forever from the book of Revelation, chapter 5, verse 5. This is again the online teacher or the OTB channel. See you again next time, only here in our channel. Goodbye.